I welcome all of you on uh, your PD education and uh, I'm going to discuss now uh, how your online telephonic or video conferencing interviews are different from actual physical presence interviews offline interviews uh, what is the difference between the two and uh, how we can prepare for uh, such online interviews now uh, due to this coronavirus uh, covid uh, uh, now students are you know, being asked to go for uh, telephonic interviews only like uh, niti bombay is already conducting that and uh, iit madras has also declared that and uh, uh, many fellowship program in management courses jinke liye aims ne interview karne the wo bhi telephonic interviews kar rahe hain so telephonic interview can either be uh, only through telephone or it can be video conferencing interview jisme skype wagaira ke through interview rahega no uh, you know uh, this interviews we have already started conducting and humne upload bhi kiya hai your pda ke upar telephonic interviews how you have to prepare and uh, you just listen to that how it is being done Uh, it is quite effective way i mean uh, students ke liye bhi it is quite easy and mentors ke liye also it is quite easy to have telephonic interview it's not difficult but yes it is different so we are not in we are not habitual of such interviews isliye hame thoda sa alag lagta hai otherwise this is quite simple interviews i i find it quite comfortable aur your pdm mein we are conducting this for the last one year now jo students ka interview hota hai they go for uh, different places we conduct that uh, online your telephonic interview only so you can learn from the interviews of others and you can go for your own interviews also let me tell you now difference kya hai dono mein i have some points here to discuss with you ek to communication jo aapka hota hai na telephonic interview ya skype mein jo aapka communication hota hai that is restricted only to verbal communication like when i'm uh, sitting in front of you i can use gestures postures hand movements body movements and uh, i can speak through those movements also like you are smiling or you are calm you are composed you know uh, confidence display karne ke do teen tarike hote hain how you show confidence in the interview number 1 you keep calm your face is calm and you are uh, little smiling also and your voice level is good and your eye contact is good ab mere ko to in mein se to koi bhi nahi hai aapke uh, telephonic interview mein other than voice level so it neither you can be seen skype pe you can be seen but otherwise telephonic mein to aap dikhoge bhi nahi so you are smiling or you are calm or you are composed and your eye contacts are good so that particular part is missing now suppose i am very good to maintain good eye contacts and uh, to smile keep smiling to wo advantage mereko nahi milega jo offline mein milta hai to yahan pe only my confidence i can display through voice level my voice level should be little loud and uh, it should be very clear and sentence should be very very straight matlab aise confusing nahi hona chahiye ki agar mere se koi question pucha gaya some question is being asked to me and i am using 10 sentences to give that answer then there will be disturbance he will not get what you are saying so what is the difference is one is communication is only verbal so you cannot use your gesture posture smiling faces and it is not going to help you out there cannot take uh, help of pen and paper because sometime question is asked okay uh, what is the yield strength okay sir can i draw stress strain diagram and show you what is yield strength so that pen and paper is not there with me now all you have to do is you have to use your communication only to explain explanation has to be good now if you keep sentences simple straight to the point that will help you you need to uh, think for a while and speak out the sentence but once you say it should be very clear the words which you choose sentence which you use the pace which you keep should be such that whatever you are speaking that transmission which you are doing that should be received in very easy way by the uh, interviewer also to jo tum bol rahe ho usko samajh aana chahiye that is going to help you in the interview so keep straight speak slowly don't be very very fast and use less sentences and do not use more sentences for that energy level should be high as i told you how to show that you are confident now on the offline you can smile you can um, uh, basically have proper gesture and posture you are very calm to wahan se lag jata hai body language dekh ke pata lag jata hai lekin off uh, on uh, line mein ya aapke telephonic interview mein wo pata nahi chalega so the most important aspect to show that confidence is your voice level only you need to pause little bit before answering when whenever you want to give some answer you need to take a pause you need to speak you need to stop think what can be the answer and you can also say that sir can i think for a while 
but don't use that frequently because he might misunderstand you are referring somebody some uh, material or something somebody is guiding you don't think that way so don't take much pauses also but before answering take five second pause and think and what sentence you have to use simultaneous talk nahi hona chahiye jaise interviewer is asking you some question and you started uh, interrupting him and you started speaking simultaneously if he is speaking stop it otherwise this will look like disturbance offline interview mein aisa hota hai he is speaking and you are parallelly speaking offline mein still it can work but online mein it cannot work telephonically mein it cannot work last but not the least we are comfortable with offline interviews because maybe we have done that we have taken many such interviews in the college vibe or something online is the first time it is coming it can be opportunity it madras is conducting off online interview is conducting somebody is calling and you are on the phone foreign university used to do that now indian universities will also start doing that more or more such interviews you can expect so only thing you have to do is practice you need to go for mock interviews you need to go for mock interviews you need to practice more your pd has already started doing that exercise and you have filled the forms many students have filled the forms and today also i have conducted such mock interviews with 10 20 students uh, of different branches we will keep on doing that we will keep on doing that and uh, watch those videos listen to those videos and uh, uh, learn from those videos uske do benefit honge ek after every interview feedback is being given and you will learn also concepts like you keep on asking sir what do we remember what do we prepare in power system what do we prepare in structures uh, soil what do we prepare in let's say uh, thermodynamics or strength of material kaisa question aayega so kaisa question aayega that also you can learn and second kis tarike se aapko mock interview dena that also you will learn and the second step will come do it on your own you should try and do it and you should learn it your pedia is the uh, platform which is conducting this for the last many months now and uh, we have expertise in this and you can really learn from these interviews which we are conducting with the students do it and learn it and get develop the expertise so that when the interview comes you are in position to score high this is the opportunity you can grab it thank you